on this day in sports. We got some baseball highlights. Where is the 36 and 73? Detroit Tigers take on the 55 and 55 Oakland Athletics. Andrew Triggs will take the mound for the A's. His 23rd start of the year. He is currently 6 and 5 with a 2.86 ERA, 77 strikeouts, over 126 innings pitched. He'll be matched up against Ryan Carpenter, the Tigers making his 22nd start. 8-9 currently with a 3.50 ERA, 87 strikeouts in 121 innings pitched for the young Tigers pitcher. Kick things off here at the bottom of the first inning. Two outs, full count for Chris, I'm sorry, Alvisel Garcia in his first action as a new member of the Oakland A's. That will follow up with Chris Davis right after him. And it's going to get under the second baseman's glove. And Garcia is going first to third on his horse. Runners on the corners with two outs for the A's. Bringing up Matt Olson, the left-hitting slugger. 1-1 count, but he's going to get under it and pop it up to the third baseman. And the A's do not score in the first. Go bottom of the third down. Marcus Simeon leading off. And he's going to single right back up the middle. Shortstop dies, but doesn't really have a shot at that one Does uh, for Glacius. And the A's are on with a leadoff single in the third. Next batter, Steven Piscotti. He's going to take it the other way for a single. Simeon's going to pull up at second base. Two on, nobody out for the A's in the third. That would bring Abasal Garcia to the plate. And he's going to take it the other way on the ground. But it's going to be a ground out. But it does get the runners over to third and second with only one away. Chris Davis now stepping into the box. And he's going to drop one into right center for a single. Both runs are going to come in. And the A's take a 2-0 lead in the bottom of the third. Next batter full count, Matt Olson, And he's going to get into one, drive it deep. And it's going to be off the wall. Chris Davis had to make sure it was caught so he didn't really get a good jump. But he goes home anyway and he's tagged out at the plate. Not sure if the third base coach waved him or if he just went himself. But that's two outs. The next batter, Matt Chapman. Swinging strike. Got to do a little cleanup at first. But the A's strand Davis. Or I'm sorry, they strand Olsen there. To the top of the fourth. Triggs now still has not given up a hit. Well, that's over now. That is his first hit surrendered of the day as he had it going very well early on in this one. That is Candelario beating it out. Almost got thrown out at first. Very next batter, Miguel Cabrera going to single up the middle. Miggy still, still killing it after all these years in the league. That would lead to Mickey Matuk with two out, two on. Going to pop up to Davis and left. And Triggs gets out of that jam. So let's go top of the fifth now. Triggs facing Vmar Victor Martinez. And he's going to double way over the outfielder's heads. Uh, but he is a very slow runner, so no shot at a triple there. As he pulls in there with a double. So later in the inning, two outs at this point. Dixon Machado with a slow base hit up the middle. And Vmart on his horse so, since there were two outs. He's going to get in there and score and... Well, the catcher had to come up and get it anyway, so he didn't really have a shot at him. So 2-1 is the score. Two outs now in the top of the fifth inning still. And the Tigers trying to get things going again. They have two on now. Full count, two outs for Candelario again. He's just going to ground right back to the pitcher. And the A's and Triggs get out of that with only one run surrendered. And now let's fast forward all the way to the eighth inning because there was real no action after that. All-star Blake turning on for his 47th appearance to try to get the ball to Hendricks to close this thing out. And he goes through the first two, no problem. And well, the third guy, no problem either, strikes him out and gets through. So let's go bottom of the eighth here as the A's looking for an extra insurance run. Chris Davis at the plate already has a two RBI single. And the fielder's going to dive and miss it. That's going to allow Davis to get into second base with a double. And just like that, that insurance run is in scoring position with one away. Q Matt Olsen now 
hit one a double off the fence earlier in this one. This one is just going to be a base hit. But Davis is going to hold up on third. Learned his lesson from earlier in the game. But runners are on the corners with one away. Couple plays, couple batters later. Jed Lowry now with two outs. Uh, going to try to get that in, and he will not. So they will go to the ninth. Liam Hendricks looking to close the thing out. 2-1 lead. No room for error to their 45th appearance. Currently has 23 saves on the year. 1.65 ERA. Absolutely killing it. First batter, 2-2 count. Mickey Matuk, no problem. Sits him down. One away. Victor Martinez is the second victim. Sits him down. So strikes out the first two. And going to get the last guy to ground out to second base. And the A's are going to come away with the win. They will improve to 56 and 55 on the year. So back above 500 are the A's. And the Tigers fall 36 and 74 as their nightmare season continues. And Andrew Triggs pitched amazing. He went seven innings in this one, gave up one run. And we didn't really need much offense because of that. And we did not have much offense. We couldn't really get the bats going. I mean, we did we did hit pretty well, but the issue in this one was failing to get runners in scoring position to actually get them in. And uh, that was pretty much a story for us today because, like I said, we had 11 hits. Looking at the Tigers, they had six total hits. Iglesias, Candelaro, Miggy, V-Mart with that double, and then Hicks and Machado. Chados was the lone run for them, and Iglesias had an error his sixth of the season. Carpenter takes the loss, goes six, gives up nine, two earned. Does not walk anybody, four strikeouts. So he didn't pitch very, He didn't pitch bad, he just had that one rough inning in the third when we hung two on him. Looking at the A's, we had 11 hits total. Like I said, we could hit. We just couldn't really hit it when we had runners in scoring position. Davis was the big guy. Threw four. That two RBI single and a double. And Davis's 45th and 46th RBI. Triggs goes seven, six hits. One earned, one walk, one strikeout. Lowers that ERA to 277. Perfect eighth and ninth for Trenton and Hendricks. That's going to do it for today's video, guys. If you want to enjoy it, please leave a like down below. Be sure to subscribe if you haven't already for more A's franchise. As always, guys, thanks for watching. Till next time, peace.